Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. So guys, I have a very interesting story for you guys today. I got this interesting email from this gentleman who says that he has bladder cancer and he heard about hydrogen and the possible benefits for cancer. So he did his research and he picked this device. He said he's been using this particular device. This is a Chinese device. Um, I, I'm not really fond of the way that it makes water, but this is the device that he chose. And I found that his feedback just incredibly interesting, which is why I wanted to share with you guys. So he's been using this for quite a while. He stated that he hasn't really got any benefits from it. He hasn't really felt any you know, difference. And he's just using the hydrogen thinking, hopefully that it'd be doing something. What was, what was interesting, he also scheduled uh, an appointment for his, uh, it's a surgery actually for his bladder because you know he has cancer and he hasn't really seen much difference. Then he saw one of my videos and he saw the device that I like and he did his research and he ended up getting one of these guys, the one that I like, the Lourdes Hydrofix. He got the premium edition, just exactly the same one that I use. The reason that I found this email fascinating is because of course he started drinking the water from this guy and doing the inhalation and he started getting results. He said that his symptoms just straight up went away just within a few months. I actually found that really interesting. He went as far as saying that he actually was canceling his surgery because he believes that his cancer is already gone. And, and now I was kind of thinking to myself, I don't know if I would go that far. I still think that you might want to get checked out. But as far as the symptoms, that is something that I can understand because I have seen something kind of almost peculiar and interesting about the water that this particular device makes. And it does make it, here's the thing, it makes it very different than this device. And I'm realizing more and more with time how to use the water properly and then also how to make it. This is not gonna really make the levels or the proper nano bubbles that really appear to make a difference like this particular device does. In fact, this is kind of cool. I was looking at my device which is the same one. And look at look at those little guys. Obviously, here's the big bubbles, right? Well, actually, those are still pretty small. But look at on the side. Look how small. And that's just what we can see. That's one thing that I, from what my, I understand with all my research, is the device that I'm using really makes the best nano bubbles apparently, that you can have. But the reason I just found it interesting is just the fact that it made a difference. You know, and I also, th I personally think that it comes down, I mean, yes, the quality of the hydrogen is part of it, but I think the huge aspect is the water aspect of it. Because I know that these devices don't really make, well, there's just about no device out there that really makes super fantastic water in regards to hydrogen. This is the best in regards to making quality water. And apparently it affected this guy's bladder differently. And as I was telling you guys before, I have seen how this affects the bladder in very interesting and almost peculiar ways. Um, like people who've had UTIs, people who've had like a lot of uh, bladder issues in regards to getting up at night and having to pee frequently. It's just interesting how this particular water is affecting the bladder. And maybe that's why this particular person is having less symptoms. I'm not really sure. I haven't got all those details yet either. But I just wanted to share with you guys. I thought, you know, this is interestingly enough, something that I, I think people would want to hear. And I think with more research and more time, we're going to learn more and more about these type of things. But it was definitely interesting, guys. So if you liked the video, definitely share, definitely hit the thumbs up, subscribe. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time on the next one.